Welcome to Beautifully Chaotic. I'm Rachel and we are a family of eight, six children, two adults, and I am bringing to you a bargain hunt haul. And bargain hunt, we live in northern Alabama and bargain hunt is a store around, I'm not sure every state it's in, but I just discovered it because it's right around my church. So Bargain Hunt is like a discount grocery store and other things. They had toys. They had home goods. They had actually pretty much all the sections that your Walmarts or your Targets going to have, but everything was discounted. And so I'm just bringing to you a grocery haul because that's pretty much what I focused on today. And um, keep in mind, this is a discount grocery store. Some things have like a, today's October 11th, so some things have already expired like the 9th of October. So this is the reason why some of the prices are really low, but I don't care. Um, and the kids were eating some of the stuff on the way home and it tasted fine. So, you know, some of these things are, um, the dates on them are sell by dates. So, or best buy dates. So I'll show you guys what I got. I mean, some of the deals are really good. I don't know if this, okay. So let me just turn this camera around. This case of 24, um, cool blue flavored. Gatorade. It looks like the sell-by date is October 26, 2020. So this was $13, which is really good for for Gatorade. Um, these treats were $1.50 a container. I think it's got how many? Does it have in it? It's got eight of them in here. And let's see when the sell-by date is. To be fair, let's make sure we pay attention to all the sell-by dates. Where is it? Hmm. Oh, here. December 11th. So that's good for um, a little bit longer. And, you know, with all the kids that we have, you know that these things are going to be gone quick. We have six children, four boys and two girls from 14 down to one years old. This one's January 23rd. Now these were $2.50. And these are expiring January 2021. These or uh, like 88 cents, I believe, and they expire October 16th. So these are chewy dips, dark chocolate. Um, these I got a little crazy on. These expire, looks like October 7th, some October 13th. Um, most of them are October 13th. But they are, I've never heard of this popcorn company, but Popcorn Indiana. Um, and it tastes pretty good. I had one on the way home. I think the, there's one extra bag here that I bought. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bags. And they were 11 cents a piece. And these bags, um, let's see, expire October 9th, 9th, 9th. So these ones expire October 9th. They're the Grill Mates Roasted Garlic and Herb, which are pretty good. And um, hers, sour cream and onion. Oh, these expire October 16th, I think. And I got three of those bags. These were, I don't know how much these were. I think they were 20 cents as well. So these, all of these big bags here were 20 cents each. And I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bags of those. And then we got two for six boxes of this Kellogg's frozen two marshmallow um, cereal and it is a limited edition uh, let me see where, where's the expiration October 14th you can see the, the top there so we got these pretty much I don't buy a lot of cereal anymore um, because it's, we can just go through it so fast, but we got this for Saturday morning breakfast and Sunday morning breakfast of next weekend. So um, that's pretty much what I got them those for. So all of this came up to a whopping $51.45. And we got, so I guess they're telling me that the estimated retail value is $137, which is crazy. Um, but I would never spend that much on this. So again, $51.45 is what I paid. 
um, for all these items. And again, I mean, oh, I didn't even go, I don't think I went through these. No, these were, there are 15 bars in here. I got chewy granola bars and chocolate flavor and then um, some in creamy peanut butter. These Jif bars, we got, uh, how many? Four boxes of these. And then we got these here. I don't know how much these were. I think these were, I'm not sure. Let me see if I can find it on the receipt. Jif. Oh, okay. So these were $2 a box. I don't know what they normally would cost, but for 15 bars, Jif brand. Uh, let's see, then again, the expiration, expiration. October 15th, and that's, let's see, all of the boxes are October 14th, October 14th, and October 14th. Again, these things go quick in our house because we like to throw them into lunches because our church is pretty far away from our house, so we like to put lunches in right after a picnic basket right after church, and these are the types of things that go in. These two expire October 20th, and they are chewy yogurt variety packs, 11 strawberries, 10 blueberries, and um, I don't know what these were. Let me see if I can find it here. Yep, they were $1.50 a box for 21 bars. So pretty good. Um, so again, like I said, my total was $51.45. About these muscle milks, um, Devon likes these mu muscle milks. Now they're non-dairy protein shakes, 34 grams of protein per bottle. I think two servings a bottle. And these expire January 2021. So good. I don't know who would be buying these. We would have them sitting around till then, but he likes them in the fridge, so I'm going to pop those in the fridge. Bargain hunt in our area. We live in Huntsville, so there's another bargain um, hunt in our area, and so I'll probably be going there to see what they have, if they have anything good for us to get. But for right now, I think we're all good for for the snacks. It's a lot of stuff um, for 50 bucks. I think that's really good. I'm really, really pleased with this because back in New York, now I would try to go to like Big Lots and Family Dollar and those places to get cheaper food items. But I don't know, I think this pretty much beat any bargain or discount grocery store that I've been to, um, even in New York. So I am really happy with Bargain Hunt and I am looking forward to seeing what else I can find. Now, mind you, they sell toys. They sell board games. We saw a couple of board games that were like $2. That wasn't my focus today, so I didn't buy those things, but I will be looking at it more and more as I get familiar with the store, as well as going out to the one here in Huntsville. So, Thanks for watching. Click the like button um, and also hit subscribe, hit the bell notification so you could be notified for each brand new video. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.